A good rice crop in the field is one thing, but less than ideal market conditions for that rice is an entirely different issue. As This Week in Louisiana Agriculture's A.J. Sabine tells us, rice growers and industry leaders learned what's influencing prices and what's around the corner for rice at the LSU Ag Center's annual field day. A trailer of rice growers and industry leaders listen as Dr. Steve Linscomb and Shian Shaw explain the latest advances in rice breeds at the LSU Ag Center's rice research station in Crowley. Linscomb told growers three new Clearfield varieties have shown promise. Uh, the CL 111 is a new Clearfield long grain. It is a very early uh, variety comparable to the CL 151 in yield, uh, but much earlier, much better grain quality. We think perhaps a little better disease package. The CL 261 is a medium grain clear field. It's actually the first clear field medium grain available for production. Looks like it's going to have very good yield potential, uh, good grain quality, and we think it's good. It's going to be a good medium grain variety that will allow us to use the clear field system for excellent red rice and other wheat control. Meanwhile, Natalie Hummel and Mike Stout show producers how rice water weevil damage can destroy root systems on rice plants. Hummel says the rice stink bug threatens the milling quality of rice. Well, the rice stink bugs can damage the rice by causing peck, and they can also cause the abortion of grains sometimes, um, depending on the stage of growth of the rice. So when they're feeding at the milk to the soft dough stage, they can cause peck, which reduces the quality of the rice, which reduces the milling value. Despite a ton of rainfall here at the Rice Research Station, Dr. Linscomb says the rice plots you see behind me look terrific. However, with 90,000 more acres of rice in production this year in Louisiana, that has many farmers concerned about one thing, price. The uh, June 30th acreage report came out from USDA, which showed some increase in acres over last year, uh, uh, pretty substantial acres in a lot of states, including Louisiana, and, and the futures prices, the nearby contracts for rice right now are just under $10 a hundredweight. So the anticipation of that increased production this year is already affecting the market. Producers on the tour also learned about rice fertility, weed control, and return crop management. In Crowley, I'm AJ Sabine for This Week in Louisiana Agriculture. Since 1909, the LSU Ag Center's Rice Research Station has developed more than 44 different varieties of rice.